Welcome Parks Blue Cross Church. Uh, we just wanted to show you our new property, our dream and our vision uh, that you guys are a part of uh, as much as we are. And we might be a hundred kilometres away but our hearts uh, to see God really move uh, in our region to reach the lost and resource the region. So we just thought we'd show you a bit of a, a tour, quick tour of our, our dream and our vision. Uh, we bought this property about three or four months ago with a vision that uh, we would uh, be impacting for the Kingdom of God. So I'll just give you a quick tour today and uh, show you through. This is going to be our reception area, our foyer area. Uh, got a few different ideas, maybe a resource area. Uh, but this is really where you come and enter. We're going to be retiling, repainting, uh, fixing up the holes and all that sort of stuff. Come this way. This is our admin office, so this is where, for those that don't know, on Tuesdays at this stage, Mount and Lindy work for the church, and this is where they'll be working. Uh, they refuse to work in here yet because of the dead mice and frogs, but uh, that's life. So, uh, this is where they're going to be working, and this is for the admin centre, and uh, yeah, excited about that. Let's go. This is, I guess, the pastor's office, my office, and uh, anyone else who needs it. Um, if you just look around in that room in there, that little cupboard in there, that's actually the youth pastor's office. So, well, it's actually more than an office. Uh, for those annoying youth pastors and interns, uh, that's where they'll be punished. That's their naughty corner, naughty room, and uh, yeah, so that's part of them. But this is an office um, that, again, we've got to paint and do a few things to, but the bare bones are here. Uh, to service that this way. I don't know if you can see down there, but down this way, this will be our uh, training room or leadership room or study room. Uh, Maybe be a homework centre, I'm not really sure how that's going to look, uh, but uh, we'll also have like a mother's room here for Sunday mornings in particular. Uh, so that'll be uh, in half, but that's fairly deep, and that'll be there. If you swing around that way, down this way will just be a lounge area, so lounges, uh, we'll have lounges either side, so just, uh, just for comfort, have a chat, uh, might have a bookcase, a few books, a few resources, that sort of thing uh, here as well. Come down this way, Andrew. What we'll do is we'll actually put in a, a wall that'll run straight down the back of that part of the building and that'll serve as our toilets and bathrooms which are down the back which I'll show you a bit later, uh, but that'll just be a hallway so you can go from the front right down to the back and use the restroom. Uh, here's, our, here's our auditorium. Uh, it'll seat uh, well over 300 people. Uh, it's quite big. It's uh, crude as well. It uh, needs a lot of work, but that's fine. Uh, not sure how it'll all work out uh, uh, layout wise but we're working towards that but this is our auditorium uh, we believe it'll be great for Sunday church it'll be great for uh, training it'll be great for conferences it'll be great uh, for uh, weddings uh, uh, it's open to the community uh, the community will be able to hire it for weddings funerals uh, all that sort of uh, thing but this is our auditorium this is really the center of the property and uh, Sunday church will have the stage over that way and the sound desk down there uh, if you can look behind me We'll run a walkway, which I just described earlier, uh, which will service the toilets and bathrooms, which are through there, and we'll go back and have a look through here now. So here's the current toilets, uh, not too uh, flash, uh, and we'll change a lot of this, the configuration of this. Um, thankfully, there's no surprises. I will just want to be open up front. We are an anti-ranger church. We don't like rangers in our church. Uh, but you know, because for a lot of reasons. Um, but you know, hello. That's why we don't like rangers. Well, too late for that one. So anyway, this is our toilets, and uh, seen one, you've seen them all. Uh, this area here, with all the pigeon droppings and all the rest of it, this will be our dining area. And uh, you know, at some stage, uh, come this way. At some stage through there, we we're putting in a big commercial kitchen, uh, storage areas. Uh, obviously, we've got to cut out some walls and play around with that. Uh, but right through here, if you can uh, go back through there, see that will be all that, all, that the steel work will be cut out. 
Uh, that'll all be a dining area uh, and we'll have a couple of doors that come from the auditorium to this dining area uh, which will also be great for uh, having uh, community lunches, community dinners and uh, you know if we've got a conference or something on where we can have coffee, tea and all that sort of thing. There's another thing we've got to show you. This part here, this part here is our community centre, it's our multi-purpose hall, uh, you know, there's a lot of different names that we've got for this, but come in. This part here is about the size of our current church, uh, without the uh, feathers, poo, grease, oil, garbage and rangers. So this is about the size of our uh, church. And uh, what we intend to do here is uh, put uh, concrete walls in, maybe a suspended ceiling, just unsure of how it all can work. But this is a really good sized building. We'll put where those two windows are down there, we'll uh, turn that into doors so you've got a straight entry into the dining area. And uh, this will just be a multi purpose hall. Different groups will be able to hire this and use this, uh, as well as a youth program, a children's program. Uh, different dance groups that use our church currently and different interest groups uh, that might want to use a hall that uh, uh, you know, can be used for different purposes. So parks, that's, that's our vision, that's our dream. We're excited that you guys are a part of it and we're part of each other and we just really want to see God's kingdom grow in our region, Naraman Parks and wherever else God leads us and uh, we look forward to your uh, help, your prayers and uh, you know, just being on board for what a great season we're in. God bless you.